This week at Design ADAC, design is getting personal. Top names have flown in from across the country to discuss everything from breaking boundaries to American craftsmanship. But the underlying theme is that today's interiors demand a personal touch. Come along as we catch highlights from the day and talk to designers about their personal approach to personal design. I'm Michelle Cannon-Smith and this is Editor TV. This week's theme is design is personal. What makes that so special here at ADAC? When the designer's designing for a client, they want to make sure that they're creating an experience, but they want to make sure that they can then customize it. So there's so many options. You know, a piece of furniture can be customized so many ways so that it becomes personal for that client. A lot of clients, a lot of designers are looking for personal design right now. How is Amesworth Noah accommodating that? There's a lot of beautiful product in the world and we sell beautiful product, but what we have is our one-on-one -on -one customer service and our relationships and I feel that in this business it's all about the relationships. We can sell beautiful product all day long, but you cannot sell the personal service. We're here at Design ADAC this week and of course the theme is design is personal. What does that mean to you? To me it means go with what you like and what you know from the inside that you want around you. Highlighting your personality in the choices you make for your home, be it color or if there's a particular texture, furniture style, whatever resonates with your personal experience from travel or just what you're attracted to. You are part of Southern Design. What is it that you find most inspiring? You know, I find that Southern Design is really kind of a nod to the past with this reference to the future. And we're going to keep our grandmother silver, but we're going to mix it in with kind of the cool Tory Burch China right now. You know, just the whole mix. That's really what I think is kind of the new South. We used to be called the Gone with the Wind State. We're definitely not that old South anymore. So just doing things that are, are not what your grandmother would typically do is what is so fun and that's where everyone is headed these days. So being here at ADAC, what is it that makes this place so special? The main thing with ADAC is the service they provide and the level of knowledge that the employees and the owners have. There is a broad range of product, of color, of non-color. It's just, to me, it's stimulating. I feel like I'm Norm at Cheers when I come to ADAC, so I can come in and you know, you know everybody. And, and there's, I guess it's a place where everybody knows your name. So when you've got designers and clients coming into this space, what feeling are you hoping to invoke out of them? I'm hoping that they'll find that one special piece, sort of like a piece of art, uh, and that they are able, even if they can't do the whole house from here, they're able to find that one piece that they're really inspired by to design the room around. Can you give us a little bit of a synopsis of what you spoke about earlier? Today I spoke about what inspires me and all the beautiful imagery that I've loved since I was a child, throughout my retail career, and now in my interior design business. It was all about the journey it took to get this book to print. It's been a very long process, a real process, rough, rewarding, but I could not be more proud of the end result. This week's theme is design is personal. How is it you guys are sharing that with your readers? Even when homeowners are working with the very best architects and designers, the designers and architects are not imprinting their own style. They're creating spaces that are really a reflection of what the owners want. And so we're always trying to celebrate personal style. Because Veranda's roots, believe it or not, almost 30 years ago, began in the South and began in Atlanta, ADAC has been a special part of the success of Veranda. So with our partnership, we're really able to bring the pages of the magazine to life. Thanks for joining us at Design ADAC, and we hope to see you in our next segment for the Southeast Designers and Architect of the Year Awards presentation. I'm Michelle Cannon-Smith, and you're watching Editor TV.